Hi everyone, welcome to uh, Wild Irish Drums. Um, we're test driving this new bit of um, technology today. So if it goes a bit wrong, you'll have to blame me for that. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to be introducing videos of the drums, how they sound. Um, we'll also be doing other videos with regards to looking after your drum, you know. For example, with the lovely Irish climate, if your drum gets wet, and lose a bit of sound about how to retighten them and all that sort of thing, warm them up. Um, all those videos will be coming with time. Amongst other things I hasten to add, but I won't uh, let you into everything now. Now, this is a 16 inch Red Deer Stag drum with Owen writing around it. Mm -hmm. um, it says um, Warrior of the Dream. And um, you can see the lacing in the back here as well. You know, uh, one thing about my drums is I don't use nails, I don't use glue, I don't use anything like that. So if anything was to go wrong, they can always be fixed. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, we'll give it a wee play, see how it goes. So, 16 inch red deer. That's a really powerful little drum. Amazing sound for the size of it as well. Um, so, I shall get another one. This one here is an 18 inch elk drum with an antler handle in the back of it. We also make double sided drums. This is a double sided 20 inch bison. Um, we also make a smaller version as well, which is ocean drums. We're all laced very similar to this. Um, now, you might hear things rattling as well um, in the kitchen here because this puts out such a lot of vibration, it does make things rattle. So. drum hanging up there and the drums hanging up behind me here drying over the stove and um, the drum up there and one up there is rattling away with the vibration of this one. some of the drums that we do. Like I say, this is just test driving this new technology. So um, let us know what you think. I might shave for my next appearance. But anyway, there'll be lots more coming with time that we'll um, be putting up um, on, on the internet and everything to help everyone out there. Um, if anyone's got any suggestions about what they'd like to know, then uh, just uh, let us know. All right, that's brilliant. Thanks ever so much now.